Good morning, brothers and sisters. Today is Sunday, and today we celebrate Passion Sunday, Palm Sunday, the very beginning of Holy Week, this most solemn time of the year. Now, in our final preparations for um, final preparations for the Triduum and celebrating the great resurrection of Jesus Christ at Easter. But before we can celebrate Easter Resurrection, we must, of course, then go through uh, the way of the cross. Um, and so picking up our own cross to follow the Lord. So, friends, let us begin our morning prayer with the invitatory. Lord, open my lips and my mouth will proclaim your praise. Come, let us sing... T- Come, let us worship Christ the Lord, who for our sake endured temptation and suffering. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God, and we are his people, the flock he shepherds. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massah, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. Forty years I endured that generation. I said they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ the Lord, who for our sake endured temptation and suffering. All glory. Hold on, I gotta get this tune right. All glory, glory, Lord, to you, Redeemer King. Nope. I don't know what's wrong with me today, folks. I cannot. (laughs) This tune is escaping me. Uh, We're just gonna recite the first couple of verses. All glory, praise, and honor to you, Redeemer King, to whom the lips of children make glad hosannas ring. You are the King of Israel and David's royal throne, who in the Lord's name comest, the King and Blessed One. All glory, praise, and honor to you, Redeemer King, to whom the lips of children make glad hosannas ring. The company of angels are praising you on high, and mortal men and all things created make reply. All glory, praise, and honor to you, Redeemer King, to whom the lips of children make sweet hosannas ring. The great crowd that had gathered for the feast cried out to the Lord, Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. For his love endures forever. Let the sons of Israel say, his love endures forever. Let the sons of Aaron say, his love endures forever. Let those who fear the Lord say, his love endures forever. I called to the Lord in my distress. He answered and freed me. The Lord is at my side. I do not fear. What can man do against me? The Lord is at my side as my helper. I shall look down on my foes. It is better to take refuge in the Lord than to trust in men. It is better to take refuge in the Lord than to trust in princes. The nations all encompassed me. In the Lord's name, I crushed them. They compassed me, compassed me about In the Lord's name I crushed them. They compassed me about like bees. They blazed like a fire among thorns. In the Lord's name I crushed them. 
I was hard pressed and was falling, but the Lord came to help me. The Lord is my strength and my song. He is my savior. There are shouts of joy and victory in the tents of the just. The Lord's right hand has triumphed. His right hand raised me. The Lord's right hand has triumphed. I shall not die. I shall live and recount his deeds. I was punished. I was punished by the Lord, but not doomed to die. Open to me the gates of holiness. I will enter and give thanks. This is the Lord's own gate where the just may enter. I will thank you, for you have answered, and you are my Savior. The stone which the builders rejected has become the cornerstone. This is the work of the Lord, a marvel in our eyes. This day was made by the Lord. We rejoice and are glad. O Lord, grant us salvation. O Lord, grant success. Blessed in the name of the Lord is he who comes. We bless you from the house of the Lord. The Lord God is our light. Go forward in procession with branches, even to the altars. You are my God, I thank you. My God, I praise you. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his love endures forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord God, you have given us the great day of rejoicing, Jesus Christ, the stone rejected by the builders has become the cornerstone of the church, our spiritual home. Shed upon your church the rays of your glory, that it may be, be seen as the gate of salvation open to all nations. Let cries of joy and exaltation ring out from its tents to celebrate the wonder of Christ's resurrection. The great crowd that had gathered for the feast cried out to the Lord, Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. God, grant that with the angels and the children we may be faithful and sing with them to the conqueror of death. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed are you, O Lord, the God of our fathers, praiseworthy and exalted above all forever. And blessed is your holy and glorious name, praiseworthy and exalted above all for all ages. Blessed are you in the temple of your holy glory, praiseworthy and glorious above all forever. Blessed are you on the throne of your kingdom, praiseworthy and exalted above all forever. Blessed are you who look into the depths from your throne upon the cherubim, praiseworthy and exalted above all forever. Blessed are you in the firmament of heaven, praiseworthy and exalted, uh, praiseworthy and glorious forever. Bless the Lord, all you works of the Lord. Praise and exalt him above all forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. God, grant that with the angels and the children we may be faithful and sing with them to the conqueror of death, Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Peace in heaven and glory in the highest. Praise God in his holy place. Praise him in his mighty heavens. Praise him for his powerful deeds. Praise his surpassing greatness. O oh, praise him with sound of trumpet, praise him with lute and harp, praise him with timbrel and dance, praise him with strings and pipes. O oh, praise him with resounding cymbals, praise him with clashing of cymbals. Let everything that lives and that breathes give praise to the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Lord God, maker of heaven and earth and of all created things, you make your just ones holy and you justify sinners who confess your name. Hear us as we humbly pray to you. Give us eternal joy with your saints. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. 
peace in heaven and glory and glory in the highest. A reading from the book of Zechariah. Rejoice heartily, O daughter Zion. Shout for joy, O daughter Jerusalem. See, your king shall come to you. A just savior is he, meek and riding on an ass, on a colt, on the foal of an ass. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. By your own blood, Lord, you brought us back to God. By your own blood, Lord, you brought us back to God. From every tribe and tongue and people and nation, you brought us back to God. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. By your own blood, Lord, you brought us back to God. With palms, let us welcome the Lord as he comes. With songs and hymns, let us run to meet him as we offer him our joyful worship and sing, Blessed be the Lord. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. With palms, let us welcome the Lord as he comes. With songs and hymns, let us run to meet him as we offer him our joyful worship and sing, Blessed be the Lord. As Christ entered Jerusalem, he was greeted as King and Messiah. Let us adore him and joyfully praise him. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna to you, son of David, king of the ages. Hosanna to you, victor over death and the powers of darkness. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. You went up to Jerusalem to suffer, and so enter into your glory. Lead your church into the Paschal Feast of Heaven. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. You made your cross the tree of life. Grant its fruit to those reborn in baptism. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Savior of mankind, you came to save sinners. Bring into your kingdom all who have faith, hope, and love. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Friends, gathering these prayers, gathering the intentions, the, the prayers that we hold in our hearts, calling to mind each of those people who have asked for our prayers, all of those people that we've promised to pray for, we lift up our voices using those sacred words that Jesus himself gave to us, echoing his own words as he taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Almighty, ever-living God, you have given the human race, Jesus Christ, our Savior, as a model of humility. 
He fulfilled your will and by becoming man and giving his life on the cross. Help us to bear witness to you by following his example of suffering and make us worthy to share his resurrection. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. And friends, thank you for joining me this morning for morning prayer from the Liturgy of the Hours. Um, again, it is Passion Sunday, Palm Sunday, as we are at the cusp, the beginning of this great Holy Week, and then entering into the Triduum, entering then into uh, the glory of the Easter season. So friends, uh, whether you are out and about today, whether you are staying in, remember to be safe today, remember to be healthy today, but above all, remember to be holy today, to finish Lent well, living out that baptismal call to holiness. May God be praised in you, may God be praised through you, and I do hope that you have a beautiful day today.